course of the Constitution. We asked some teachers this question. What do you think is the most important part of the Constitution? And this is what they said. The most important part of the Constitution is the Bill of Rights. First 10 amendments to the Constitution. And then all the amendments they've added since then. What do you think? So? Why? Because yeah. they guarantee people's rights. That's what protects your freedom of speech and freedom of religion and freedom of the press and freedom of assembly. Um, I think one of the most important parts is the preamble because it summarizes what the Constitution is about and it's order to create a more perfect union for the people and give them rights, freedoms, uh, liberty, uh, justice, and the pursuit of happiness. So some of the basic freedoms and rights that every human being should have. I would say to promote general welfare. Thank you. Thank you. We need to obey our laws. That's the most important part. Freedom of speech. What, what do you think? Because you should be able to have a voice. You know, a lot of countries you're not able to speak. Um, you're not able to speak freely. So freedom of speech, um, you should be able to say um, how you feel about certain things, the government, you, you know, things that's going on in your neighborhood, in your schools. I mean, that that's how we we become a better country. You know, you you you're able to have a voice and speak and show your concerns and what you want to improve on. To me, the right to, to free speech. Why? Why? Because in my country, we don't have free speech where I come from. If you say something against the government, they kill you or you disappear. Here, I can say anything about the president. I can, as long as I don't threaten to kill him. Um, yeah, so free speech is one. The right to worship, because there are countries where you are not allowed to worship other kinds of religions. The right to due process. You know, if you do something, you have to go to a court, you have either a judge or you have a jury of your peers, those kinds of things. In some countries, you don't. Police officers will shoot you before they ask questions. Most of the teachers agreed on amendment number one, which is freedom of speech and religion. And some of them agreed on the freedom. The Constitution is composed of three parts, the preamble, the articles, and the amendments. The preamble describes the purpose of the document and the government. Tranquility provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessing of liberty to ourselves and our posterity. To ordain and establish this constitution for the United States of America. Yeah. Yeah. The articles talk about the separate powers of the federal and state government and how to change the constitution. Amendment 1. Freedom of religion, speech, press, assembly, and petition. Amendment 2. Bearing arms. Amendment 3. Quartering of troops. Amendment 4. Searches and sieges. 
5. Criminal proceedings, due process, eminent domain. Amendment 6. Criminal proceedings. Amendment 7. Civil trials. Amendment 8. Punishment for crimes. Amendment 9. Unenumerated rights.